Hello my loves, welcome to your singles reading. This is going to be for March 1st to March 15th. Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs, okay? All right guys, let's get started. Holy Spirit, Angel Spirits and Guides, what messages do we have for my Scorpios, please, Spirit? What clarity and guidance, what love messages do we have for my single Scorpios, please? Holy Spirit, Angel Spirits and Guides, my single Scorpios, please. March 1st to March 15th, please, Holy Spirit. What advice, what clarity and guidance can we bring to my single Scorpios, please? Holy Spirit, Angel Spirits and Guides. All right, my loves, so... If you're currently subscribed, welcome back. And if you have not yet subscribed, please go ahead and click that red subscribe button on the bottom right hand corner underneath this video. I do choose multiple winners every week, guys. We've changed it to weekly. So it's going to be on a Sunday. Every Sunday, we're going to be announcing the winners. I give away free readings. I give away uh, tarot cards, oracle cards, uh, Palo Santo, jewelry, sage, you name it. Okay. So be sure to like, share, comment, subscribe, click that notification bell all right guys if you would like to book me for a personal reading follow me on instagram check out my timeless collective readings check out my um my tarot collection um if you would like to check out my new channel divine spirit healing 1111 all that information is in the description box below okay so let's get started scorpio <clears throat> The nine of pentacles so guys you are single and looking good independent i feel like money is good everything's good and for those of you who money is not good i mean it's just you're radiating certain light you're in pre-empress mode okay you're truly ready to enter a connection we've got the page of swords here aquarius gemini libra energy somebody has their eye on you scorpio we've got the high priestess cancer piscean energy but they're not speaking they're not saying anything, but they're definitely watching you. And with the devil card, whew, Capricorn energy, this person is very sexually attracted. And I feel like they're pretty much like obsessed here. With the five of cups, oh, it could be an ex. This could be somebody that really regrets uh, walking away, guys. This could be someone who's really uh, jealous or, you know, they're watching you. They're watching you, social, social media. They see that you're looking good. They see that you're doing good, Scorpio. And this person is uh, not happy. They're very regretful. With the lover's card here, Gemini energy. Um, I'm feeling, you know, the lover's card in the traditional Rider weight is a man and a woman and there's a snake wrapped around a tree. So I feel that someone here is looking in on your on your life, on your connection. They, they're looking to see the decisions that you make, the lovers that you take, your boyfriends, your girlfriends. They're watching you like this is like straight up stalker ish. I mean, we've got the, the page of swords, the high priestess and the devil card back to back like you straight up have a stalker four of wands this could be a soulmate this could be a twin flame this is somebody that definitely wants to come back in and offer stability the king of cups cancer scorpio pisces energy but i feel like you're in your divine masculine here you're not showing emotion towards this person at all with the two of cups this could be a soulmate it could be that's why this person maybe has trouble separating with the two of pentacles you you are not sure if you want this person back in your life guys you're very undecided um now scorpio this could be you this could be you wanting someone back with the emperor here we've got aries taurus energy um this person might be older than you but they could be very stubborn very strict very rigid and you know you like a little bit of spontaneity you know what i'm saying you like to have a good time um this person could possibly be an ex-husband an ex-wife the mother of your children the father of your children with the king of swords and the emperor back to back this person may have been very strict very strict very strict maybe even condescending um definitely not someone that likes to enjoy life aquarius gemini libra energy or you may be juggling two people here scorpio you know what i'm saying you may have this emperor looking in on you and you might be dating a king of swords possibly We have the six of cups, the X, and the world. Yeah, you've shut you've shut the door on this person. With temperance card under the deck, Sagittarian energy, you have closed the door on this person. So this person does not stand a chance. But um, Scorpio, I'm feeling that for some of you, you may um, 
Yeah, for some of you, you may have to deal with a little bit of a stalker energy here. You may have somebody that is definitely like you feel them sitting right next to you just watching your life. And it may make you a little bit uncomfortable here. I'm not going to lie. Um, because you're looking really good. I mean, you're fine. I, I feel like you're independent. You're doing good with life. You may be dating with that lover's card. I feel like you're very stable. You know what I'm saying? And um, yeah, this person, this person... Or you might be dating somebody right now and they're very, very jealous about this. So let's see here. Let's pull some romance angels for you guys. Spirit, what messages do we have for my Scorpio singles, please, Spirit? What messages do we have for my Scorpio singles, please? New love. You may have started dating someone new here, Scorpio. A new person has stirred your romantic feelings. Um, and this person is this ex is yeah this person that you're very sep that you're separated with is not happy at all. So you guys may be single because you're in separation and you've met someone new and this person is livid. Yeah, finances and career. So I feel like maybe someone here wants to come back, put the work into this connection. Um, I feel that, yeah, one person may want to work on this and the other person is retreating. The other person is, is pulling away. You may be married to this person, possibly, Scorpio. Yeah, you may be married to this person. It may have been a, a deep commitment with this ex. Like maybe you were living with them or maybe you have children with them. Um, but you you want to get away from this. You do want to get away from this. You have this new love here that I'm feeling. You feel that, you know, they could be the one. You know what I'm saying? They could be the one. You've already met the romantic partner that you seek. But this ex, and I feel like it's getting a little ugly here. Yeah. So we've got healing family issues. This person wants to come in and, and reconcile. They may try to, you know, if you're just newly dating somebody or it's like a newer connection, um, this person, they want to come back and, and hurt this connection. This person has real, you know, has real feelings for you. Um, and they don't like it. That devil card. I mean, you've got the, the page of swords, the high priestess and the devil back to back there. That's, that's scary because that means that they're like, right there like they're watching your every single move and you don't even you may not even know about it but this person is on you you know what i'm saying and they're watching you they're watching this new connection um so yeah they're they're very much there <laughs> they're very much there and on you and they do not like this guys so if you have not met anyone new yet and you're currently in separation from your person, you may meet somebody and you're like, wow, this is the one. Like it may take off very quickly, Scorpio. Um, or you could be dating somebody and it's new, you know, but oof. Abundance. Keep a positive mindset. Manifest exactly what you want. Gratitude and bliss. Yeah, this person is seeing you as abundant, especially with that nine of pentacles. Like you're doing very, very well. And soulmate, soul connection, partnership agreement, soul contract. I feel that you've met a new person and this new person is a soulmate. And I feel like this person from the past. Yeah, you see this person that you ended things with, with coffin endings, bring new beginnings, growth, change, liberation, and transition. This person is seeing that you've really sealed the coffin with them, that you're not coming back. And they don't like that. They do not like that. See, separation, again, sadness, missing you, thinking about you, yearning, unsure of future. We've got separation here twice, guys. And this person is yearning for you. With that devil card, it's almost like obsessive. It's almost obsessive. Girl talk, time with friends, moving on, happily single, living in the moment and having fun. You're having a great time here, Scorpio. You're having a great time. You've moved on. You're having a great time. You've moved on to new love, but this person is not letting it go. We have stabbed in the back, heartbreak, pain, separation, deception, shocking attack. I feel like this person seeing you with someone else, it's like killing them. It's literally straight up killing them. Like even though you're separated from them, even though you're not with them, they still are taking, watching this as like, 
you guys are in a relationship and sleeping with someone else. Like, that's how seriously they feel about it. Even though you're separated from this person and they have no right or control over who you date and where you're going, they are taking it like you guys are together and you're cheating on them. Um, you know, so I would just be careful with this person because it's it's a very serious and, and pretty dark energy. Like, they are, like, on you, like white and rice. Whether you know it or not, this person is watching. Okay? All right, guys. I love you. Please be sure to like, share, comment, subscribe. And I will see you guys soon. Bye.